to the first review of 2021. My name is Dextech, and tonight I'm going to be finally reviewing Subtronics Cyclops Recordings compilation, which consists of three compilations, which are Boot Camp High Knees Headquarters, Psychedelic Division, and Heavy Artillery. Now, each one of them have different styles and obviously are different artists such as Control Freak, Calcium, Geekui, Nasphere, Level Up, Leo Tricks, and others more. So yeah, let's just get into this. We'll be starting off with Boot Camp High Knees Headquarters compilation. And the first track is Subtronics Tractor Beam. So here we go. Okay, that started off, that was really great. I really enjoyed that one. Definitely something I will go back and listen to in my, you know, in my, listening in my headphones or in my car like, because that second drop, it literally felt like it was like laser beams, like shooting like, da, 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 like I really enjoyed that part. Damn, that's some really good ass sound design right there. Okay, so moving on to the second song is Akio's and it's called Makura. Thank <laughs> you. 
not. Okay, Duper there. Uh, that was pretty fucking awesome. I really do enjoy that one. And just the sound design and the groove that it gives is it's just pretty amazing. And the second drop when it goes to the fake out and it goes like. Like it reminded me a little bit of Tractor Beam as well because it kind of does almost a little bit of the same thing uh, in the second drop. So yeah, I really do did enjoy that. So yeah, now moving on to the third song. It's by none other than CC and this one is called Poison Muffins. <laughs> That was a pretty good ass song. I really did enjoy it. Uh, the flow was really great, and especially the part when it goes like dun 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 dun. dun that that was pretty clever. I like how it uh, it works. So yeah, now moving on to the fourth song, is by All Ross, and it's called Malfunction. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
Sounds like it was going to go out really, really fast here. So yeah, uh, that was pretty great. <clears throat> it works really well. I like how in the intro, it just really sounds like something you were here, like in, in an arcade or you went in a spaceship and you're stuck and you know, it's uh, malfunctioning. That's something like you could hear and probably the effects as well, like something you would hear from like an Aliens movie. So yeah, I really liked it. And also I like the fact that for the build up there wasn't you know like going like da 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 like something like that. It just goes like uh like it gives you tension and then when it's going to come out uh using like a filter then it goes like da 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 and then it goes hard like da 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 like that that for me was really great use it was uh a clever of sound design and you know a structure. So yeah, but I will admit there were some parts for for like a second, like it felt a little bit empty. Like I don't know why it just it, it did for almost like in in the mid drop there was a certain part that for me like it felt empty. But other than that, it's pretty dope. So now moving on to the fifth song, which is by Phonon and Mad Dubs, and it's called Wheel Up. So I could tell like in the background when it's doing like dun, 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 dun. Like that part I can tell it's falling out because it gets you like almost like some gas like
So yeah, that was pretty good, and the flow is it works, and yeah, uh, it does give me a little bit like a sophotronic pass out uh, vibes because of the vocal, and as well, it does give play rhythm vibes because of the drum patterns. You know, like the the snare, the the certain parts when it goes like a, I guess like seven fourth, if I'm correct, and yeah, uh, it works. It still works. So yeah, I really did enjoy it. Now moving on to the last song of this compilation is by Leo Trix and it's called Dissatisfied. So yeah, I really did enjoy that one. Little tricks, nailed it again. I mean, the uh, combining all the melodic with the heaviness, it just works. And that second drop, it just goes. Din, da, din, din, da, din, da, din, da, din. I mean, that that sound design just. Ugh, I really liked it. So yeah, now moving on to the second compilation 
of Boot Camp, which is Psychedelic Division. And starting off, the first song is by Chi and Subtronics. Sub, uh, sorry, Subtronics. And it's called Point Breeze. And their styles just work so so good. And the best thing about about this is that you can tell their styles apart. So yeah, that that song was pretty great. I like how their styles just mix so well together and you can tell them apart at the same time. So that's one of the reasons I really enjoy it. And especially when it goes like dun, 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 like I can tell that part was subtronics because if I remember correctly, I saw it on one of his Instagram stories that he posted of him uh, working with this song. And that part specifically so yeah i really did enjoy it now moving on to the second song is by easy baked molokai and saga and it's called killjoy That part gave me like almost virtual ride dream logic vibes because of the sound design and how that was structured. Yeah, that was pretty good and that uh, don't listen to 
like this type of music that much but it's pretty enjoyable and just the sound design itself and the structure is really enjoyable so yeah and this is the first time I've heard of Molokai and Saka Easy Big I've heard before but Molokai and Saka this is the first time I've ever heard them so yeah and now moving on we got Abalation and this is one is called Kill Them and I also never heard of Abalation so this is gonna be obviously my first time hearing him or her or them <laughs> that's going like like in the like the mid range or something like I don't know like it feels like it should be like more louder hey you killing them And yeah, that song is pretty great. I mean, not in for me personally, it's not something like, oh my god, but it, it kind of works. Uh, the sound design is really impressive, and but also it kind of lacked a little bit, like in the first drop at least, when it goes like that riser in the background, like almost like a watery riser. I don't know, it, feel, it feels to me like it should be louder, and but it wasn't. And But I do also like the drum patterns, you know, it gives it its groove. So, yeah. Moving on to the fourth song of the compilation. It's by Smith, and this one is called Swing. And also, I never heard of Smith before. <laughs> That, oh my god, <laughs> that, that artwork. <laughs> okay, I like how this is sounding like. <laughs> bad but I feel like it should like it's almost like compressed like you're having a filter or something and you know it's not expanding like, I feel like it should be like Okay. 
So yeah, uh, it's not bad, but I feel like it should have been like way more louder and go like wah 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 like something like that. But if I don't know, like having it uh, compressed, you know, to each one their own style. But yeah. Now moving on to the fifth song is by G Space and Caveman, and it's called On the Block. pretty sick i really did enjoy that one because of the second drop specifically like the first drop is not bad but you know uh feels almost a little bit compressed as well the second one it feels like expanded more and you know just went in on the sound design like going heavy like like i can hear that in the license and i'd be like holy fuck now that sounds really good so yeah, I really enjoyed that one. Now, moving on to the sixth song of the compilation is by Blank Space and it's called Comp Component uh, 17. So yeah. But then it just picks it up 
with uh, giving it variation and that's how I end up liking it. Yeah. Pretty good, pretty good. Kind of started a little bit like, um, a little bit empty, but then picked it up and I liked it. So yeah, that was pretty good because of the sound design and just how it gives you like, a, again, UK Dirty Talk vibes. So yeah, moving on to the last song of this compilation is by none other than Kill Feet and this one is called Foolish. That was pretty good. I did enjoy that one because of the sound design, the flow just works. And uh, this one it has more variation and it sounds more expanded than some of the others. And yeah, I just really liked it. Uh, so like it had variation and you know, like more life to it. So that's one of the reasons I enjoyed this one a little bit more than the others. And yeah, that's it. Moving on to the last compilation for Cyclops recordings is none other than Boot Camp Heavy Artillery. And yeah, uh, let's get started. The first one is Control Freak and Van Fleet Wire Weight. Thank <laughs> you. 
like it. It's pretty enjoyable. Yeah, that was pretty, uh, pretty good. Starting off with a solid track from Control Freak and Van Fleet. Uh, that's pretty good. The sound design as well and just the general flow, uh, it works. So yeah, I really enjoy it. Now moving on to the second song is by Calcium and this one is called Death Wish. <laughs> This is pretty fucking awesome and heavy, like it really fits the compilation. That, that was amazing. I really enjoyed that one. Calcium outdid himself on that one. That was pretty freaking amazing. Now, moving on to the third song is by G Kui, and this one is called OTM. Really liked it. Really liked it. Uh, yeah, uh, the sound 
design works, but the thing that I have a problem with was the snare. It felt really weak. I really did enjoy that one, but the only problem with I have is the snare. It just sounds really weak. Like you could have kept it in like in the first drop, but then in the second drop. <coughs> Sorry. That's <clears throat> so what I was saying. In the second drop, you could have uh, change the snare, you know, to get more variation, more light to it, but it just feels so weak, that snare specifically. So, other than that, it's a pretty dope song. Now, moving on to the fourth song, it's by Nosphere, and this one is called Gaussian Traveler. I really did enjoy that one. The sound design on this one was impeccable and it really did remind me like something Subtronics would do. So yeah, I don't know, maybe he was inspired by him to make this one. I don't know, but it's pretty amazing. Now moving on to the fifth song is by Level Up and it's called Satan Works Alone. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah, I like this one. I like this one. Uh, it gave me like almost a little bit of old school dubstep vibes. Uh, you know, like, like, uh, yeah, yeah, that's that. And I don't know, it kind of reminded me a little bit of like excision, like just a little bit. I don't know, like maybe the style. Uh, but I really like that, and especially like the melody that like, gives you like Halloween vibes. Like it's definitely something I would hear in during that uh time so yeah uh, moving on to the last song of the compilation which is subtronic screensaver vip and this one is probably probably a lot of people have been waiting for this so yeah let's just get into this <laughs> That was Subtronics Cyclops Recordings compilation of <sighs> Jaime's Headquarters, Psychedelic Division, and Harry Artillery. Uh, each one of them is really great in their own uh, style, and the ones that I really enjoyed the most from Jaime's Headquarters was Subtronics Tractor Beam, uh, Akio, I'm oh, sorry, Akio's Makura. And uh, also, uh, uh, Little Tricks Dissatisfied and CC's Poison Muffins. Yeah, like those four are the ones that I, I really enjoyed the most. Uh, I'll rouse my function and phone on Mad and Mad Dubs will up are pretty great as well. But uh, the ones that I mentioned before were the ones that I really enjoyed the most. So, moving on to uh, psychedelic division uh, the ones that I did enjoy the most were uh, G and Subtronics Point Breeze uh, Smith Swing uh, G Space and Caveman on the Block uh, Blank Space Com Component 17 and Q Feet Foolish and for the last one Heavy Artillery the ones that I definitely enjoyed the most were Calcium's Death Wish Nosphere, Gaussian Traveler, and Subtronic Screensaver VIP. Those three are the ones that stood out for me the most in that final compilation because they were so uh, heavy and well sound designed and just threw me off. You know, like uh, I really enjoyed it. So, yeah, that was the entire compilation. And I really hope you enjoy watching this video. And please leave a like and Subscribe if you want to and click on the notification bell to keep you guys updated on my next videos. And yeah, this is Dexic signing off. <laughs>